In this video, we are going to learn how to use QGIS in order to calculate area of each of those polygons and export it into Excel, for example. Welcome to GeoCarto, a channel dedicated to GIS, cartography, and geoscience. So subscribe if you want to get more tutorials. After opening QGIS, we are going to import the shape file that we are going to work on. To do this, head over to layer, click on it. Go to add layer and then click on add vector layer. Go ahead to this button, click on it and then navigate to your work folder in order to import your shape file. So after finding your shape file, click on it and click on open. After that, all what you need to do is just to click on add and then close. As you can see, I imported successfully the shape file of my area of interest. So now what I want to do is to calculate the area of those polygons so before doing this we'll go ahead and check the coordinate system of our layer in order to do this right click on your shape file go to properties and then go to source so as you can see our shape file is in wgs84 coordinate system so it's not a projected coordinate system so we need to project our file so just close the window and in order to reproject our shape file go to vector and go to data management tools and click on reproject layer we are going to input our shape file in input layer and in, in the target crs coordinate reference system we'll go ahead and click on this button in order to look for our uh, projection so in my case i will reproject my layer into UTM zone 32 north. This reprojection may vary depending on your work area. So in my case, my shape file is located in Europe. It's the shape file of Switzerland. So the corresponding zone in the universal transverse Mercator UTM is 32 north. I will click on OK. And here you can Specify where you want to output your reprojected shape file and you can name it. So just click on this button and click on save to file. Then name it and click on save. And click on run. Then close. So as you can see we got our new reprojected shape file. Now we will go ahead and calculate the area of each polygon in order to do this. Go to your new shape file, right click on it, and then click on Open Attribute Table. So, this is the attribute table of my shape file. So, my shape file corresponds to the administrative regions of Switzerland. If you want to get this shape file, you can watch my video on how to download the boundaries of any country using the Geo Boundaries website. So, now I will go ahead and create a new field the new column which will contains the area of my polygons in order to do this click on this button open field calculator and from here check create new field and here you can title your field and for the output field type click on decimal number and we will go ahead now and calculate the area now we'll go ahead to geometry click on it and we will use this button area with the dollar icon double click on it and click on ok so here we go we got a new colon containing area of, of our polygons so if you want to export for example those numbers you can come here and select the attribute table and you can click on this copy button and we will go ahead for example and export those areas into excel so just open excel click on any cell and right click and you can click on paste as you can see we exported our attribute table with area values those values are in meter this is why we reprojected our file into UTM in order to get areas in meters so from here you can play with your values and use them for your 
geospatial analysis. So thanks a lot for watching and subscribe if you want to get more tutorials.